your younger selves, when you go back to that rec teams, when you're coaching against each other, and as you're learning this, what would you go back and tell your younger self about this concept of preparing your teams and developing your kids and playing? Rotations are eliminated, but what would you go back and tell your, your younger self? Well, I, you learn along the way, like, this is about learning. And if you're, if you're not learning as a coach, your players aren't going to learn as they go through this. Uh, when I came, when I started my Tough Enough teams, I was a football coach. I can tell you one time we were playing up in Rancho Cucamonga and somebody left their, their helmet laying on the, on the floor of the dugout. I took everybody's helmets and bags and threw them out on baseline road and the cars are slamming on the brakes and there's helmets and bats, $300 bats all on and the, the parents just sat there and they didn't say a word because they had some real, I wouldn't do that now. But you learn as you go. When I started working with Gary, the only thing Gary told me is, hey, you can't yell. That lasted about six months. In fact, today was still on the team. Uh, but you just grow as a person and learn how to deal with people. And today it's even more important that you you better learn how to adapt to the players and what you're doing. Because if you're not learning, your players aren't going to grow. So I think that when you go back to just more, when you get more mature, you look at things a little differently as you get older. But um, the fire doesn't change. I, I get as pissed off now as I did when I was 35. But uh, you just learn how to control it differently.